Constructivism. Constructivism was the last and most influential modern art movement to flourish in Russia in the 20th century. Beginning in 1919, it grew out of the Russian Revolution of 1917, just as the Bolsheviks came to power. It borrowed ideas from Cubism, Suprematism and Futurism. It was an artistic and architectural philosophy, a rejection of the idea of autonomous art. The movement ended in 1934. It rejected the idea of art for art's sake. The artwork was typically totally abstract, with the emphasis on geometric shapes and experimentation. Constructivist art was optimistic, but would not tend to be emotional anyway, and subjectivity and individuality were submused in favour of object universal forms. Emphasis was put on constructing the art. The architects uh, typically included glass and steel, machine-made building parts, technological details such as antennae signs and projection screens, abstract geometric shapes, and a sense of movement. Famous artists of this movement are Naum Gebel, Vladimir Tatlin, and Alexander Rodchenko. Alexander Milhalovich Rodchenko was a Russian artist, sculptor, photographer, and graphic designer. He was one of the founders of constructivism and Russian design. He was married to the artist Varha Stefona. He attended Kazan Art School. His most notable works are Pure Red Colour, Pure Blue Colour and Pure Yellow Colour, Stairs and Books, the advertisement poster for Lenge's publishing house. In this 1924 poster, Rochenko combines the two media in an image that is mechanical and linear. The text, in big, bold block letters, is clear and legible. No flourish of the hand is evident. The photograph is of a woman who appears to be calling out the Russian word for books. The woman is Lily Brick, a fellow member of the constructivist circle. Her image has been manipulated and integrated into the bold design. Rochenko uses red and green to make the image stand out. As red and green are complementary colours.